People often ask us what is the difference between American-made kits and EU-made kits. We have two production facilities. One is here in Estonia in Northern Europe and another one is in Salt Lake City, Utah. Our good partners are making Abrama kits over there. And uh, since the pricing is different, people want to know what's the difference in kits. And today I want to explain that. First, the kit includes materials and it also includes some services like drawings. Because to start building, you need to get your plans approved first by a local authorities. And US kit has engineered the drawings in a way that it's compatible with the codes of all 50 states. US has a federal building code which is accompanied with a local building codes. And uh, they've made it so that it complies with the federal already and uh, takes into account most of the 50 local codes. So uh, all you have to do is just to position the house on the land and they offer it as a service at Salt Lake City. You don't need to hire an architect first to get your plans approved. Uh, our US team will work closely with you to modify the drawings to put it in your plot plan and you can just get it approved with your local authorities. Then. The EU kit comes with a set of drawings with, a, with all the building characteristics and uh, you need to take it to the local local municipality and ha have it pre-approved first, then you need to hire an architect who will, who will actually put the house onto your land and then you can start building also. This drawing set includes everything for building the foundation and the wooden structure. The second main difference between EU and US kit is the material. The uh, US kit is entirely made from LVL. LVL stands for laminated veneer lumber. It's specially engineered lumber where thin slices of lumber are glued together with a special glue and it's very strong, very light and EU kit uses the same material on the ceiling beams but uh, the rest of the construction is made from C24 strength-graded uh, strength lumber. This is our regular lumbers, stamped with C24. Uh, it means that uh, all the pieces are strength-graded, so in the factory they are either bent or hit to make sure that they don't break. No, the roofing patterns the structure, everything is made from kiln dried spruce wood. But US kit is entirely from LVL. Therefore, it's slightly more expensive, but it is stronger. And they use LVL, which is manufactured in US. So US people get local materials. Plus, as said, it's very strong. It complies with all the local requirements. Also, EU kit trusses are positioned in every 48 inches. US, just to comply with the local codes, have it every 24 inches. The foundation, EU kits have three strips of concrete. US kits have five strips, again, for added strength and stability. US kit is uh, engineered stronger because uh, they do have the uh, areas with a seismic activity, earthquakes. They engineered it so that, uh, yeah, you might not need it in Minnesota maybe, but uh, if you want to build one in Florida or California, you need to meet the code. In EU, it's mostly about snow loads, but A-frames, they don't take snow loads because of the very steep roof pitch. Also, the hardware. The US kit has a specially manufactured hardware from the steel, and they fix it 
to the LVL which is pre-drilled with holes so it doesn't take much time on the building site and will give you a very strong result. EU kit uses for fixings these Swiss made screws which are very very special very strong they are from hardened steel from here and here and unhardened in the middle so even in case of a hurricane it may bend it won't break and as a conclusion US kit is a bit more pricey but it's it's for a reason you get a very very strong engineered product with the additional service of not needing an architect if you are planning to build in US uh, please contact our US partners by visiting their website avrameusa.com and make an inquiry they have a great sales team to help you and get it built <laughs>